Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Hope we're all having a great day today and we're all doing well. So if you've logged into Rainbow Six Siege recently and checked your notifications tab, you may have noticed that there's something quite new and different. Now basically there's a new notification that says new content available and then it goes on to say go to your loadout to equip these items and you know, it's kind of like there isn't really any new content as far as I'm aware and if you look there isn't any new content at all and it's very interesting if you actually look at the image of this uh, notification you can see some guns you know you've got um, alibis um, alibis gun you've got the MPX by the looks of it and the SMG 12 and um, if you look at the MPX it looks like there is a you know different type of scope on it now at first you can mistake the scope for an ACOG but, you know, who are they really going to give ACOG to on the MPX? They're not going to give it to Valkyrie, and let's be honest, they're not going to give it to Warden, considering that they're both two speeds. And if you kind of look at it a bit closer, it kind of looks like an ACOG, but not exactly like an ACOG. And um, I have a feeling that this was accidentally uploaded, and this is actually one of the new scopes that we're going to be getting next season. Now, basically, yesterday Ubisoft released some sort of, like, little uh, update on the biggest concerns for the community and they said some stuff like uh, talking about how they're fixing a lot of uh, drone glitches and everything and um, a lot of the audio fixes which is something I may go into another video but I'm not going to talk about that right now but there's a bit that says uh, ADS sensitivity per zoom level and you know per zoom level the only gun that really has a zoom level that's different is uh, Kali's uh, sniper she has an adjustable scope and I guess the zoom level is different from holographic and ACOG so like holographic red dot and uh, reflex have a different zoom level than uh, ACOG does be that this is worded it's just it does not feel like they're talking about Kali or the way that ACOG and holographic are different ADS's it it feels like they're being a lot more specific than that and it's just the way that it says we are adding the possibility to set a specific ADS sensitivity for each zoom level. There's only what three different zoom levels like I said that we know of and you know this is definitely something new. So I've done a bit of digging and uh, for you guys who don't know uh, reddit user zero bytes who has leaked a lot of stuff in the past he's actually leaked um, some stuff about some new scopes in the game and potentially coming next season. So uh, basically, he managed to find some pictures of these sites, which I'll show on screen and everything. And you know, um, definitely look like new sites. Uh, as far as I'm aware, we are getting them next season. So this would align with the fact that um, when you're getting a new sensitivity change for ADSs, if we're going to be getting different scopes. And this is a very uh, interesting thing because uh, it's, a, it's a great indication that uh, you know we're going to be getting this stuff because Zero Bytes actually managed to also find, I don't have any images of it, but um, he managed to find individ individual sensitivities of a one time, three time, four time, five time, and twelve time scopes. And you know, let's go back to what Ubisoft said that they're updating the ADS and sensitivity thing, uh, so you can have the possibility to change uh, your ADS for each different zoom level in the game. That would match up with a leak that we're going to be getting a one time, uh, three time, four time, five time, and twelve time scope. So. Um, I think basically with this new little news report and update feed that Ubisoft uh, gave us, they practically just confirmed the leaks that we are going to be getting new scopes in Operation Shadow Legacy. Now, um, I think that is really cool and I think that's definitely in line with this image that we got about new content available and seeing a new scope on Valkyrie and maybe the other scopes on the MX Storm and the SMG 12 maybe they're new, new scopes as well who knows um, but that is that is you know this is the first time we're going to be getting a new scope since the actual scope the the site named scope was added which is on uh, which is on Caden Nomad's pistol and it's on Gridlock and Capital's LMG and I think it's on something else but I can't really wrap my head around it right now but we are definitely getting those scopes and um, you know uh, MPX is definitely getting one so by the looks of this image if this image is just like a little mock-up that they've used for advertisement and it's actually not in the game then you know fair enough uh, MPX might not be getting a new scope but if we're going off this MX, uh, image that means that MPX is going to be getting a zoom scope uh, what? Uh, you know, I couldn't imagine 
them giving it to Valkyrie, so maybe we're going to be getting like a Warden buff where he has some sort of zoom scope. But what difference is that from ACOG on defense? Maybe it doesn't have the exact same level of zoom, maybe you know it'll be like a one time zoom or a three time zoom. I'm actually not sure what type level of zoom ACOG is. Um, maybe this is like an ACOG rework that we're getting. Maybe ACOG's going to be removed next season and we're going to be getting all these different scopes next. I, I don't know, we're, we're going to have to wait until the official reveal, but. I don't know, I can't really imagine them saying, oh, we won't give Warden an ACOG, but then we'll give him one of these scopes, which are kind of like an ACOG. Who knows, I'm just theorizing here, but um, that's all there really is to talk about. I just wanted to kind of, you know, put my point across by saying, uh, with this new Ubisoft update feed, and with this notification, they've basically confirmed these leaks that we are getting new scopes in Operation Shadow Legacy. But that's all I've got for this video. If you are new, consider subscribing to the channel. Drop a like rating on this video if you did enjoy it. Dislike it if you didn't. And I shall see you on the next video. Thank you all for watching.